Hello everybody, this is Kyrex with the start of This Week in Kyrex for 2020. Today is Wednesday, January 1st, 2020. Happy New Year everybody, this is Mountain Blade Warband. Nope, I've played the tutorial on my own time. Just not on this file. So, I'm not very good at this game, it's just kind of a thing. I, I, I just enjoy it. We're gonna go male. We're gonna go noble. Uh, assistant. Smith. And, uh, Wanderlust. So what I just did was I did a bunch of things to determine my starting stats. Um, we're gonna... Just gonna kinda look around. You know what? This. This will be my, my banner. Alright, so. Uh, I have a way I like to play. And it's kind of cheesy, I'm not going to lie. I, I really cheese the system pretty damn hard. Okay, so first off, what we're going to do is we're going to try and get this to 9. And let's go... Strength or Agility, Strength or Agility. Um, wow, my weapons are garbage. Okay, let's go with a Strength. So, uh, first things first. Man, my uh, I think I get a Crossbow? All right, let's get this to... Hold on. Let's reset that. Perfect, okay. Uh, one, two. One, two. All right, now I've got more skill points to play with. Let's get my biggies. I'm going to want uh, tactics. Training. Tracking's pretty good. Uh, prisoner management. Leadership. What's leadership do again? Ah, yes. Good, good with that. Um, wound treatment? Yeah. Uh, surgery. And... Uh, shield. Okay. Uh, enter name. We're going to be Kyrex, because of course we are. And done. We're gonna randomize this a couple times till I find a face I like. You know what? Sure, let's go with you. You're Kyrix now. Now, <clears throat> here's the thing. Uh, I think it's I think it's these guys that I go for. But we're gonna go to Squadia. This will come up later. We're gonna ignore all the story shit. Unless I try desperately to remember how I play. Okay, cool. Perfect. Perfect. And now we just kind of run ahead, and he's going to do his thing. Uh, don't expect me to do a whole lot in terms of reading this, because again, this is This Week in Kyrex. What's this do? Ah! Oh, I didn't know that was a thing! Nice, okay. What he's doing is he's hiring me like, hey, you need to get five dudes. Now... What it wants me to do is go into here and into towns and get guys, but we're not going to do that. We're going to go... Let's see. Yeah, we're going to go here. No, it's here. We're going to go down here. This will make sense in a little bit. I promise. We'll have our pay. We'll have our fun. We're just going to surrender for now. Wait, how much money do I have? Is 
It's like, oh, you don't have 77. That's what I thought. But yeah, these guys down here are where I want to be, I believe. Yep, these guys. Now, it's going to be a bit of a pain in the ass to get here at first. But trust me when I say this will pay off. There's no party. Okay. I'll worry about bandits later. Wow, really? We're just going to start with everything fucking looted? That's garbage. Let's get some food and such. So, uh, not too much has happened. I actually just finished recording this here in Kyrex. I haven't even uploaded it yet. Uh, I have mostly at work been working on Pokemon and getting caught up on other stuff when I got home. There we go. That's what I need. <clears throat> so, um, I've actually been really tired the past couple days because I have not been getting enough sleep. Because what happened was... Uh, Christmas Eve, I went to see three movies. That being um, Star Wars, Cats, and Frozen 2. And on the way home, my bike's making, you know, clanky noises. Because it does that sometimes. But it's making sounds like something's up with the chain. So I'm thinking, oh, I never oil the thing. It probably just needs to be oiled up. Let me go do that. You know, so I went home, oiled up the chain. Tried to go to Circle K to pick up something. And uh, as I'm going up there, my chain keeps slipping off the bike. So I'm thinking, well, this isn't good. So I get my friend to call and say, hey, can you come over sometime on Christmas? <laughs> you know, get the bike a look, do your thing. Everything has a price, even your life. That's what I was afraid of. Yeah, see, this is the place where I really don't want to be in fights. So yeah, this is going to be me sucking for a while. I gotta say, as much as I love this game, the controls are awkward as fuck. And that's putting it mildly. Like, this, this is not a very good controlling game at all. that I've gotten so far. Three. But anyway, long story short, my bike was completely fucked. The uh, chain was busted, the... Um, chain was thrashed, the back rim 
or the back bearings were completely wrecked. And, um, the pedals were fucked as well. So that made it pretty much impossible to do what I needed to do. So my friend has been picking me up from work for the past couple days. And, uh, and taking me as well. I think, no, I was about to say, I think we won, but not quite yet. <clears throat> the problem is, when he takes me into work, he takes me in at, like, 11.30, when I'm normally used to getting to work at, like, 1.30 or so. So... You can imagine that gets pretty bad for me when I'm used to going to bed at, like, 5 in the morning. How many did I kill there? Gonna kind of follow them around, see if they can find the next guy. Because they usually have a better sense of the battlefield than I do. There he is. Now the reason I don't like to fight here is because every bad guy is on horses here. And that's a win for us. I'm honestly shocked. So yeah, we're going to take all of these guys captive, or at least as many as we can. Return, we're going to take all their good stuff. And that's actually a goodly amount of money right there. More importantly, we're going to go to the party. So, the reason that... Uh, that I love these guys so much is because everyone here is a horseman. Everyone. Just flat out. They're all horsemen. So, now as you can see, horsemen are devastating to infantry. So, when I take these horsemen from this area and go, say, up here, then suddenly things get a lot better for us, you know what I mean? My men would like a word with you about your purse and your belongings. Yeah, the problem is we need to get the fuck out of here while we're healing and such. Wait, did I lose all my soldiers? Motherfucker, I lost all of my soldiers? Hold on. God damn it. Yeah, we're gonna... See what do I got here? The numbers I'm looking at are eight forty five, forty four, ten. Stick with that horse for now. Uh, Eleven six. Go with that for now. Fourteen.
Resistance 2. Those fuckers take my crossbow? Think they did. But yeah, uh, I, I cannot really stress enough how big a deal it is to have the crossbow. Or not the crossbowmen, but these horsemen. Because they will absolutely trivialize so many fights later on in the game for me. I mean, it honestly gets kind of stupid how strong they get. Now, the kicker being, I have to make it out of their territory with my soldiers intact. And I have to basically do some training with them. If I can keep them around long enough, then they will do enough training to basically get uh, the level ups that they used with me, where it's like, oh, they're now horsemen kind of thing. Stand and deliver. All right, I think we can beat these guys, if only because I am on a horse. And again, do not underestimate how much even a single horseman can turn the tide. Just for mobility alone. I mean, look at what I've already done to them, and my guys aren't even here yet. This is just me. Wait, do I have a second shield equipped? That's so stupid. But yeah, all of my guys have bows, so that makes it fun. And of course, the horse itself will do damage just by running into these guys. Say nothing of what I'll do to them. I lost one of mine. And that's us winning, with a lot more than just like three guys on my side. I say as I now have exactly three guys on my side. don't I want from them? Anything, really? Let's get rid of the boats.
and that'll do it for now. <clears throat> Give me some fun stuff to play with for a little bit as we go back up to here. So yeah, now we're going to show this off. Charge the enemy. Nine versus nine. Let's see if I lose anybody. My guess is no. My guess is I won't lose anyone in this fight. Like right now, these guys are all just horsemen. Later on, I'll have horse archers, and then things get real ugly for them. See? No casualties. Took them all out. See what I mean? Simple shit. Let's actually go here real quick. We're going to go to the marketplace and we're going to sell some shit. Let's see. Let's get rid of that. And. Wow, that's a lot of money. Okay. You go to the tavern. Who are you? You're just a dude. You're a mercenary. You. Perfect. Alright, so he has joined my party now. He's what I refer to as Lieutenant, where basically he's a special guy whose job it is to just add to your party skills. And it looks like his specialty is trade. There we go, Forest Bandit Camp. There we go. All right, now, we're outnumbered. There are 11 of us and 16 of them. I'm pretty sure we still got this, though. And we'll find out soon enough. Because, again, all of us are on horseback and none of them are. I'm gonna hang back, let my men hit them first.
There we go. I'm about to say, can I f fucking hit someone, maybe? Meanwhile, they're hurting my horse a lot. Ah, uh, we lost one. Oh, looks like one of mine's down. Nice. I lost one, two got hurt. That's okay, though. So yeah, I just like to sit around here and gather up money and soldiers and all that fun shit. Stand and deliver. So we've only got eight versus their nine, but again, we're on horseback, they are not, and that makes a huge difference. I love the fact that before anything really even started, we killed two of them right away. That's two of you dead. I think this guy might be the last one. No. Looks like there's at least one more. None on our side. Hmm. Hmm, works for me. There we go, now they're much better. And we're gonna level me up as well. So let's see, I've got my agility up now. Let's, um... Get that uh, one-handed weapon up. Let's get my archery up as well. Actually, let's do pole arms. There's a reason. I want my Weapon Master increased. Um, prisoner Management up. Trade? Not yet. Um, persuasion. No. Engineer? Not yet. Um, first Aid. Yeah, that'll work. And there we go.
Actually, wait. Um, one more to first aid. Actually, uh, wound management. Okay. I'd slit your throat for a trinket. All right. So again, we are at a numbers disadvantage, but we are at a quality advantage. Like, I will put my 8 against their 10, no problem. We're actually going to sit up on this hill for a minute and watch what they're doing. See how quick this goes in our favor. Up. See, now we've already got uh, arrows out. Missed. So, one of the perks I've noticed, uh, getting back on topic 20 fucking minutes later, with uh, Pokemon Sword and Shield is that almost every Pokemon is catchable, including stuff that's supposed to be exclusive from one game to the other. Like, there's a couple dragons that I shouldn't be able to get, but due to max raid battles, I have. There's also stuff like uh, Solosis, which is uh, a Reuniclus, rather, the final form that I just have from a max raid battle that's supposed to be shield exclusive. So it's easier than ever to just get the Pokemon you need. Bit of a tattered. Basically, I'm going to start getting rid of shitty shit. Just in general. I mean, I'll keep the stuff that I can sell for a good amount, like horses, but... Okay, let's do this again. Sturdy. <clears throat> Thick. Hunting bow. I think the rest of that's all mine. Another 156 dinars. Good stuff, that. And we're going to go to Suno again. Some soldiers are already ready for an upgrade again? I'd slit your throat for a trinket. I mean, sure. Let's let's do this, I guess. Interesting. Man, look at those sabers they've got. That's some scary shit. Well, this is my question of where they are. I'm going to need to mostly pull back from the battle now, because that. I trust my men to be able to handle this, though. I mean, like I said, it's a quality thing. It's it's a bit out of the way to get them this early in the game <clears throat> without being in that region, but it's absolutely worth it because look at them. They're just cutting a swath through these fuckers. I mean, granted, it's not like a two-to-one advantage in their favor, but 
you know, on paper, we should be losing these matches, and we haven't lost a single guy since. Yeah, we, we've actually developed kind of an absurd amount of money. And I'm cool with that. I'm thoroughly cool with that. Okay. Three, let's get all horse archers for this one. Alrighty, we're going to visit the tavern here. You're just mercenary swordsmen, huh? How many do I have? I just want to see here. Uh, marketplace. Well, that's a lot. Step, step, worse. We'll sell you. Keep the other one for now. So how many swordsmen is this? Because I've got enough. For, no, not for five dudes. You fucking high? You're high or something if you think I'm gonna pay that kind of money for four for five dudes. Alright, oh man, you're hurt pretty bad. Let's let's have a talk with you. Alright, what are your skills? You are just flatly all around. Okay, that's cool. Um first off, that's gotta go. You're gonna get some good shit. Oh, that's actually even better than that. You can have this. It's 2710. Um, hide boots are the same. You need a, a hat. Gotta have a hat. This this can be your hat. Um clubs, nice. What is that? 20? 209870? It's a little slower, but it's good. Here. I have one of my Nomad Sabers. Um, I'm going to give this to myself. Do I still have arrows? I don't think I still have arrows. Oh, no, I have, I have arrows. It's my bolts, right? Yeah, fuck bolts. New is going to be arrows. Perfect. Um, still got on bread. All right, that'll do for now. Do 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 do. do. Uh, I'll go to not there. Yeah, fuck it. We'll go to Pravin. Go to the tavern. I'll sell the, the guys I have right now. Wandering Scald, you're not a dude that I need. Caravan Guard, not necessarily. You're something else. Okay, let's go to the Arms Merchant and sell. All of the shit. Wait, let me see here. 15. I don't think it matters if you sell them to the thing. Like, I think I can sell arms to the armor merchant and whatnot, but I'm going to try not to do that. Uh, 
we're gonna get a horse for him real quick. <clears throat> Hopefully he's good enough to ride one. Now we're gonna talk to you, equipment. Uh, give you this hood instead of that hood. Let me just make sure. Yeah, thought so. Well, now he's got a good horse, he's got a better hood, he's got good armor, he's got a weapon. Nothing ranged yet, but hey, nobody's perfect. Uh, marketplace. Horse merchant, sell that. Arms merchant. Let me check a thing here. I mean, I could. You know what? I will. Get down. All right, one more time. We're going to do the whoopity thing where I change up his weapons and mine and shit. We're going to talk to you, see your equipment. I'm going to get the good arrows. You're going to have these arrows and this hunting bow. There we go. Now we're ready for bed. Oh, excuse me. Fucking looters. Yeah, looters aren't a big deal. They have, like, no weapons and ammo or weapons and armor to speak of. They're just, like, clubs and naked or wearing shirts or something. Uh, the odds that we're being any danger from them are pretty much non-existent. Matter of fact, if they're if I'm going the wrong way, as I suspect I am, uh, the battle could very well be over by the time I get to it. I need to get the fuck out of here. Because if I go down, we lose the fight with all that that implies. So let's not have that happen, please. I'll just trust my men to win this fight for me. And they did. With no casualties. Fuck it. I'll hire you. I don't care. Mine. 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 Sure, why not? <clears throat> now, we're actually gonna... I don't even know what we're going to do, but we're going to do something. Let's see. We'll go here. Go 
go to the tavern. Oh, lovely. Perfect. I got money. All right, back to the tavern, please. There we go. Perfect. Watchman. Hi. Engineer, huh? Hmm. That is a lot of money, but I got two new skilled people to join me. Not the tavern, you fool. The marketplace. Um. I'm still good on money. Eventually some bandits will come out. I imagine, anyway. Fifteen to their eighteen. I'm not concerned. <clears throat> Plus, I've had time to heal since last time. Oh, wow. They're right there, aren't they? Still, not a concern. Not a concern at all. Never underestimate the high ground. I love the fact that, for all intents and purposes, the Kurgits here are Mongolians, and I fucking love that. And I am an equal opportunity warlord. I don't care who you are. You're welcome in my army. Oh, that's cute. He thought he was going to get away. Ah, oh, oh, okay. Just, wow, Marnid gets hurt a lot, doesn't he? We're going to abduct your ass. I do want to capture that man. There we go. There's some much needed money. Um, two ready. We'll do these two lancers, uh, horse archers, veteran archers. Perfect. Um, Yamira. She's ready to level up. 
Let's see your skills. Um, you, you're going to be a skill girl. Uh, we'll save your weapon for now. Let's see. What, what's your thing again? Horse archery. Probably. Inventory management. Yes. No. Um, trade. That's good. Uh, First aid, surgery. We'll build your archery. That sounds good. <clears throat> Not that I have anything for you yet. Uh, you. You are my siegeman. Engineer's already maxed out. Good, good. Um, you can focus on surgery. Oh, wow, you're a hell of a fighter. Uh, we'll, we'll save you until I actually know what your weapons are. And that just leaves me. Gonna build up my archery. Now that's a thing. Um, power draw. So that I can, you know, get the good stuff going. No, those are just farmers. All right, let's kill these enemies. Gonna need to get some more horses soon. I think we all know where that's gonna come from. Yeah, remember the Mongols effectively conquered the Eurasian continent with horse archers. Just an unspeakable amount of cavalry and no infantry, so. That's kind of my inspiration for using the guys I use. And it works. It really works. They're very hard to fight. I mean, unless you happen to have really good soldiers. Uh, one got away. Damn it. Two got away. Double damn it. Oh, your mirror's hurt. That's not good. Yeah, money. Oh, the peasant woman traded to upgrade. Camp follower, huh? Nice! Good for you! I was wondering what you'd turn into, if anything. And you upgrade to a huntress. That sounds intriguing. So we're going to go down here. Actually, not there. Not there either. We're going to go in here. Wow, every place is fucking looted. That's not good. Also, notice how suddenly it's like, oh, soldiers are ready to upgrade. That's because um, my training skill. When you have training, sometimes it'll just upgrade people. Man, these places are looted as crap. Mm. 
Mmm, I don't want to fuck with them. Those are horsemen deserters. They can, they can desert, I don't care. 20 bandits. No. That being said, we're going to call it here for now. See you next time, everyone. Bye-bye.